Howdy ho, Reject Nation. Greg Alba here. John. We are going to watch the teaser trailer for Shane Black's Shane The Predator. Before we do that, patron of the day shout out to Mikhail Linden. He is a fairly new patron eject. He is actually from a small village in Sweden. Sweden. In the past couple times I talked to him, it's you know, a lot about his enthusiasm for Sweden. And he's even been encouraging me to go on vacation there. And he wanted me to encourage all of you guys, since most of our subscribers are from America, to take a look into Sweden because it's apparently a beautiful place to vacation. A lot of great musical artists come from there. And more importantly, Mikhail comes from there. He is just a very, very lovely kind-hearted human being so thank you so much mikhail for joining the patreon page we're gonna come to sweden and we're gonna cuddle with you oh yeah then we're gonna put on some abba it's gonna be great it's finally here <laughs> it's not christmas <laughs> shane black's got a new holiday <laughs> What? <laughs> so the kid summoned the ship. Did you see anything unusual? Like an alien, you mean? Oh, that guy. You saw something. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and you man, someone or something tore him to pieces. I think they're attempting hybridization. Of course they are. They're yeah. upgrading on every plant they visit. We need to know if you pose a threat. Yeah. We're assassins. Isn't posing a threat kind of important? Whoa! Wow! <laughs> Looks like they're taking a page out of Requiem. <laughs> yeah, heavily. <laughs> I'm surprised how much this trailer reminds me of that. It's kind of an underwhelming trailer in some aspects. And after all the hype of waiting for a teaser trailer for so long, honestly, when I was watching this trailer, I kind of feel like this is a mismarketed trailer already. Yeah. I think what they're trying to do is remind us of the Predator franchise and what it's become for those hardcore Predator fans. And I think what people have been wanting it to do is kind of harken back a little bit more similar to the first Predator, which it doesn't look like it's doing. No. <laughs> and then on top of that, this is Shane Black's movie. You get a hint of humor in that one moment where like he saw something, you know? And I've, I've read one thing of what Thomas Jane talked about and other people have talked about how there's gonna be a lot of that Shane Black style and humor in this film. And I oh, just I don't bet. think they know how to market it yet. It's just a teaser trailer. So I think what they're trying to capitalize on is like horror action i just don't think that's gonna be the exact tone of this movie what this teaser trailer is communicating i think that's why it feels a little bit off in the way this is marketed because i have a, a strong impression that the vibe will feel very much different yeah. kind of like when shane black did iron man 3 and then we got a completely totally <laughs> different so trailer <laughs> yeah. we'll find out halfway through that the predator is not even the predator <laughs> yeah. about it. I, mean, I thought the motif of the kid you know playing with the part of the the big like gauntlet thing was was cool and that's sort of about it i mean like yeah. i'm excited about the cast you know you got the yeah. logan guy doing the logan character <laughs> yeah <laughs> yeah i didn't really get much personality or much flavor and i thought they could have like teased or hyped up the predator a little better yeah. i i really <laughs> yeah. don't th think it's the actual movie like i feel like some people might actually look at this trailer and go this movie looks like a cheesy 90s action flick or something because that's or like the, the flat or something yeah because that's it's kind of the vibe the trailer is giving. I really think that the movie is going to be a lot better than what the trailer is marketing it as. I feel like, yeah, the, the movie is probably, I just expect this movie to be a lot more, I guess, pleasing or, or, or satisfying. Yeah. Like, I feel like Shane Black probably really knows what people want. It's not hard to tell, like, doing another Earth Predator 
Order movie might be a little bit of a tall order after Requiem left such yeah. a bad taste in people's mouths. It's like in a small town. And yeah, yeah, yeah. It, yeah. Does, it, do, it did have that Requiem look. Surprisingly, hey, yeah. I, was, I, I wasn't expecting to flash back there. The Predator getting hybrid technology upgrades it seems a little bit cheesy. See, I, I feel like there's going to be a sense of humor about it that this trailer is not communicating, so instead it comes across cheesy. Don't yeah. worry. The, the next trailer, they're going to show a whole different thing where like Believer's going to start playing and they're going to yeah. introduce the whole squad <laughs> of assassins. Some Imagine Dragon gonna, song will you, play. You got Sterling K. Brown, you got Keegan-Michael Key, Michael Key, Key. And, and Thomas Jane. Thomas in this, Jane, in this movie yeah. too. And you know, Olivia Munn. Mm -hmm. The Predator design looks pretty cool. I mean, it, it, it looks it looks like modern day, like slight upgrade to it. I mean, the cinematography looks cool and uh, it's a Predator movie and, and I, don't, I really don't know how people are responding to this trailer. What the Predator franchise has evolved into after the first great one, I really don't think it has a bar too high to hit on <laughs> this one. I just really hope oh, we get it's like... It's gonna be good. I think this movie will be a lot more fun. I have a lot more personality than what we currently got. And it's just a teaser, so hopefully the official trailer yeah. gives us a much better taste. Alright guys, well, what did you think of this Predator teaser trailer? Was it a bit of a letdown? Did you like it? Was it exactly what you expected? Put your comments down below. You guys can subscribe to the Reject Nation. Click that notification bell because subscribe buttons don't really work. And uh, check us out on Patreon. Full length TV show reactions, weekly Q&As, a lot of stuff. Come stuff. check us out.